Um, get longer working around these monsters makes me uneasy. I'm I'm gonna blast him. I'm gonna blast him. All right, here we go. The Great Sitkin Island, Alaska. Hello everyone and welcome to Fossil Fuel. This is a dino horror game. And when I say that I'm scared, I mean it. I am terrified. This is gonna be, this is gonna be rough. So if you guys like this, there are two games. We're gonna check them both out. In 2025, the Sierra Research Institute made a major genetic breakthrough by cloning two extinct animals, the Samaritan Rhino and Dodo Bird. Nice. As the financial benefits grew, a massive underground facility was constructed to house a new trillion dollar initiative. I'd actually like to do this one day. This is actually one of my dreams. To bring back extinct dinosaurs. Hell yeah. Part of the reason I went for biology actually. Okay, this is, oh, this is gonna be rough. It's gonna be real rough here. But yeah, welcome to Fossil Fuel, guys. I got this, I got this. Sierra Research Institute, 500 feet underground. Right, nice. Yeah, this game, uh, so far, first impressions with the intro and everything looks pretty damn good. Okay. Thank you, buddy. You too. One sec, guys. Got to change some stuff here. The sound is a little bit too high. All right. I think I fixed the sound. Everything should be good. Let's check this out here. Welcome. In the pause menu, you can view your player controls. So you can also adjust the game and controller settings. How to interact with objects. Uh, yeah, approach it, you'll be prompted. Door, some, some automatically open, some need to interact with. Switch or key. Okay, cool. We got clues. Be sure to inspect the environment around you. I like it. Blue crates can be broken. Find random items inside. We got a backpack. All right, keep in mind you have, to, you have limited space. Okay. Uh, money. Collected credits can be spent at the shop to buy items and ammo. And defeating enemies give you XP. Your speed and jumping will improve. I wonder if there's any parkour. And blue laptops that you can save your progress when you see them. Okay. Right, go to the meeting room. Oh, that must be the sanitation procedure. Hey, bud. What's going on? <laughs> Thank you. Oh my here, god. <laughs> this guy talks just like me. And it's already started. Well, get your stuff from that cubby over there, and I'll get the security door unlocked for you. Alright, thanks, brother. Appreciate it. Okay, I think we can save on that. I'm not gonna do it yet. Tab to view inventory. Oh. Okay, so click tab. That's not tab. A light that can be attached to a helmet. Oh my god, we can craft? Oh, okay. I got it now. That's pretty cool. It will last for weeks and does not take standard batteries. I like that though, because in reality, your helmet's not going to go out every 30 seconds. You need to like get new batteries. So that's cool. Good morning. As many of you know, we have a new game warden joining us today. Oh, no way. Are we actually a game warden? Uh, we are all very saddened by the loss of our previous warden, Isaac, but it's time to move forward and welcome our new team member. A mandatory meeting is to be held at eight o'clock for all staff so we can introduce the new game warden as well as go over some new safety regulations here at the base. Additional notes, maintenance has informed the administration that possible power drains should be expected over the next six hours. These drains are expected to be mild and will not interfere with day-to-day -day operations. Somehow, I doubt that. Regards, Elon Musk, <laughs> Sierra Director. Damn, Elon Musk? Oh my God. Okay. Remember, Maximum precautions around specimens. Yep, will do. Okay, I don't know what way we're actually supposed to go, so I'm gonna go off this way. Welcome Play to the Sierra Research Institute. You are currently at the specimen transfer station where prehistoric life brought back to the okay. power of modern science is cataloged and transferred to this 
Nice. Oh, they talk about stuff here, like the Utah Raptor. Ah, one sec. Oh, crap, I lost it. Are you done? All right, one sec. All right, Utah Raptor. Up to 2.5 meters. Oh, my God. This is going to be fun. And they are... That, that's pretty big, by the way. 2.5 meters for my American friends. That's, like, pretty big. I don't know how to describe it. All right, I'm, I'm already seeing something I want to go check out. Right here. Ooh, a little bit of money. How do I... How do I turn on my flashlight? There we go. Okay, a little bit of free money. Absolutely. So I... Yeah, I take it I'm not allowed to go this way. But good thing we got a little bit of money, though. Okay, man... Oh, my God, that's bright. Mandatory meeting. All staff, 8 o'clock. You must be the new game warden. Yep. The orientation room is right through those doors. All right, thank you. Ooh. Damn, that's a change-up. Mandatory meeting. All staff today, 8 o'clock. So I guess I go in here? Whoa, what a cutscene. <laughs> what the fuck? Maybe all the lights went out. Nope. <laughs> what? Oh, there we go. Holy shit. <laughs> that's that's definitely a... Whoa. All right. Anyways, eat or interact. We are going to save the game. There we go. Oh, I heard something. Door requires a blue key card to open. Yeah, what do we have in our inventory? Uh, we picked up something. Oh, we got a map too? Oh, damn, this place is massive. Okay, there's quite a few guys around here. Maybe we can ask one of them. Wait. Hold up. Your flashlight will attract attention. Use it sparingly. I hear something massive. Okay. What do we got here? Um, I don't know if I want to go in here. Seems to be safe, though. Holy shit, this is sketchy. That's blood. All right, stay calm. Shit. If he gets... First encounter? What do you mean, first encounter? Oh, what the fuck? How do I hide? Oh, I see his tail. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah. Holy shit. Oh, he's eating him. I kind of want to go now. I don't want more to arrive, but he could stop at any moment. This is evade. Oh, he's eaten. What was that? Oh, that's money. Those are credits. This is of no use. Okay. Just gonna carefully sneak over here. Good, good, good. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. All right, and I'm gonna close it behind me. How do I close it? Okay, we should be safe. All right, so we got several doors here. We go to the left. Was that smart to do? It seems to be fine in there. I kind of want to get in there. 
shit. I, I don't know how to stop sprinting, but we got a way to go this way and a way that way. I'm going in here. Okay, come on. Um, empty syringe. Okay, can be combined with a serum. I think that's health. Let's go. Oh, bolt cutters. So, from what I heard, that was really loud. The door closing. Not too thrilled about that. Shit! <laughs> okay, um... Inventory. We don't have too many items. Let me see. Uh, if I combine this with this, now we've got health syringe. Okay. What the fuck? What the actual fuck? Are you kidding me? Okay, we have no time to mess around. I'm keeping the lights off. I'm not gonna... I'm gonna close this door. Okay. And I'm also gonna turn this off. Oh, I left the meds. Shit. Okay. We gotta go quick. Oh yeah, this is just one big loop. Think we could hide behind this desk if we have to. Right? Nope. Come on. That was loud. Oh my god, we got a gun. Um... Make sure to arrange your weapons at the top. Yeah, don't really care right now. I can't- oh shit, I can't get in there. Um, get longer working on these monsters makes me uneasy. I'm- I'm gonna blast him. I'm gonna blast him! Holy shit. I feel so much better with a gun now though. Okay. Oh, I don't like this door being broken. And I don't like that they can enter these places. How do I turn the lights back on? Wait, hold up. Got a flashlight. I didn't miss anything, did I? He was a heavy smoker. Okay. Yeah, I'm not worried at all now that I got a gun. But I have a feeling we're not really going to want to be... Oh, hold up. Damn, these guys have a lot of syringes, which... I don't know. That's kind of weird. But uh, I don't really know how often I want to use it. Because we got very limited supply from what I read. Okay. Um, we can combine this. Oh my god, this is so difficult. This and this. Drag this to the top. We got plenty of ammo. Okay, good. Let's let's get out of here. I really don't want to be in here much longer. So I'm guessing this was the one from this canteen, right? Yeah, you must have came through here. Okay, this is a super long, spooky hallway, and I definitely don't want to go down it. Let's go this way instead. So I wonder, can they open these? Or was it just because the gate was lifted? Hmm. Can't get in, but there's some really good stuff in there. Oh, look at that gun. In a grenade? Door cannot open with the power out. I definitely see power. Guess that means we only have one way to go. Okay. So I see power panels on the sides here. So this is... Shit. Oh, I see it. Just went by to the left. Okay, now it's going to the right. I think it's going through the middle. 
I kind of just want to kill him and get him out of here. I think I hear multiple. One hit to the head. That's all it takes. Okay. Stay dead. Let me. I want to take a look at him, actually. Oh god, where'd he go? Oh my god, did, did he get back up and run? Hope not. Let's keep going. Okay, that's like. Oh my god. Okay. This is head of security, Lieutenant Finley. Mm hmm. Specimens of Cayman breaches have been reported. Yeah, no shit, they broke out. Are to report to sub level officers immediately. Sub level officers. Where are they? I just. I think I just saw one get eaten. Okay, headshots kill him. I can definitely take out a big group. We got plenty of ammo. As long as it's just Utah Raptors, I think we'll be fine. And that might be a safe spot. Okay. What do we got in here? Locked it says Old Betty. Oh, there's definitely a gun in there. Um. There's no way I can. Oh, shit, I can't. Okay. Not sure how to do this yet. But we've got money. I'll take it. Cell phone is broken. What happened to it? Ooh, maybe it was sabotaged. We got a little bit too much of that. Nice gaming desk, though. <laughs> yeah, it's really, really fancy. Photos is Europe trip. It feels heavy. Ooh. Blue key card. Wait, so did I take it? This key opens a door that corresponds to the card's color. Right. Um, yeah, absolutely gonna save the game. Okay, good. I like those plants a lot, actually. Um, called Lucky Bamboo, but they're not actually bamboo. A little fun fact for you. Okay, so we saw them in there. It's kind of hard to see. They went off that way with the body. Okay, that way's impassable. So, now what? God, I hate these boxes. All right, let's get out of here. Let's run. All right, so I'm pretty sure this is the blue door. Wait, where did we come in from? Okay, there's a switch that operates this. Originally, we came through here. And our meeting was supposed to be held in there. Oh, okay. First aid kit? That's a lot better, actually. Another broken cell phone. Maybe we have, like, a signal jammer going on? Okay, we opened up this door, but that also gives them another way to come in. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really digging this. I, I don't want to go that way. Oh, this way's opened up. Wait, no, we came from in here. This is where the meeting was supposed to be. Then everything went to shit. You know what? I'm going to save again. There we go. Okay, so what about this way? That's a blue keycard door, I'm pretty sure. So we don't want to go that way yet. Let's go this way. Check out the security gate. Hello? Nope. <clears throat> I'm gonna go this way. Oh no, the little security robot's gone. Oh, okay, I know where that is now. That makes sense. Cannot be opened with the power out. Okay, so we do want to come back here eventually. Wait. Hold up. Oh. Sharp blade, a last resort weapon. Hell yeah. Um, I guess replace that. Alt to quickly access. Yeah, there is no... What? There's no way that's going to happen. Alright, anyways. I'm good to go. A 
Let's open this bad boy up. Seems to be clear. <clears throat> okay. Oh my god, he insta-killed me. Are you shitting me? I'm playing a normal. Good thing I saved the game, but my god, I think I just crapped myself. Okay, let's try this again. This time I'm gonna be a little bit stealthier. That is complete bullshit that that happened, though. <laughs> oh, I'm not gonna sleep tonight at all. This is rough. So he came from in here. And I want to go in there, but I'm going to wait a sec. There's a way down. I am determined to get whatever's behind this door. Let me bait him out. Oh, you sneaky bastard. Why was that so fucking loud? What the hell happened? Okay, that's- I think that's meant to kill you. I don't think I'm supposed to survive that. Oh, it was a toilet! I guess that makes sense. Okay, let's continue. That was, <laughs> I definitely don't think we were supposed to survive that. S to climb down. Okay. Great. Subterranean caves. And biodomes. Just what I like to see. Ooh. Pump action weapon that has a large spread when fired. Hell yeah. I mean, I like my, my pistol right now. But, take it. What is... Wait. Um, What did I pick up? Oh, shotgun shells. Yeah, I definitely need that. Plus four slots. Okay, I'll pick up my, uh, my other thing again. Animals getting out of their pens. There's just a massive explosion. What the hell is going on up there? I came down to check on the animals and half of them have escaped. Rocks have fallen too, blocking the main passage too. Sorry. Rocks have fallen, blocking the main passage too. Each paddock door has a built-in breaker, so I was able to flip A and B back on to keep the remaining animals in their pens. Oh no. Luckily I've got my shotgun. Okay, they got to him from inside of here. So we are bringing out the shotgun. And actually... I'm going to switch locations right there. Yeah, that's better. Okay, so we... Oh, what was that? That was not a Utah Raptor. Shit. You are currently in the subterranean biodome. Okay. This complex system of caves are both natural and man-made. The biodome is completely self-sufficient. A 100 right. acre underground preserve. 100 acres? Habitat has been recreated in painstaking detail to fit the needs of our highly valuable prehistoric guests. Okay. I'm going to turn off my light now and get low. Wait, what's the pin? Uh, did you have something else on you, buddy? I moved his legs up. Um, we gotta have, like, a pin number somewhere. Maybe I'm not supposed to be down here yet? Oh, here we go. With the power out, I'm sure the technicians don't have any of the door codes written down on good old paper. Paddock A door code is 5566. Jared Morin. Okay. Whoa. Why did it get dark? Alright, anyways... Okay, uh, enter. Welcome. Okay. Oh, I don't like this at all. It's so quiet. Yeah, there is no sound here. What? What keeps happening? It's like the lighting goes on and off. I don't know what's happening, but it keeps blinking. Maybe I need to take a health thing. No, I don't think that's it. But I have a feeling we want to avoid the light. Okay, where are we going here?
Um, I see a bunch of lamp posts. I think we want to get. I think we want to go pretty much all the way around this. Just make it to the other side, like a big U shape. Oh, we could just cross through there, though. All right. I don't hear anything. Shit, I hear something. Oh, we're definitely not alone. Yeah, the lights are dimming. So dark. The fuck? Why is that happening? I don't like this. I should be safe. Mm, I'm backing up. I don't like that. Oh shit! Okay. I think we're fine. Um, taking a syringe. What the fuck? Alright, I'm going loud. I'm gonna kill every last one of them. Oh, nice. Oh, there's a bunch of shit here. Come on. That one is glowing. I don't know if he's dead or if we just put his head down. Okay, we gotta be quick. Semi-auto. Oh my god, it's silenced. Enemies will no longer be alerted when fired. I wish I would have picked this up first. Director is a madman. I found out he has an inner circle of fanatical bioengineers working on crossbreeding man and dinosaur. What? He had me thrown to the pit and left for dead. Oh, that's not good. Dinos are bad enough, but I really don't want to be messing with... Hold on. Um, you know what? I think... I think this shotgun is just better in every way. So let's... How do I move it? I'm not really sure how to move this. Oh, there we go. So we'll put that one down there. Okay, lots of ammo. Let's get my ammo set up. Get my health all set up here. All right, doing pretty good. We need more inventory space though, but that is so messed up and really cool. And I, you know what? I'm not going to lie to you guys. I would also really be interested in those experiments. Would I do them? No, but I do want to look at their research if we get a chance. What did we kill over here? It was glowing orange. Oh, is this where they drink? That's so cool. All right, I saw something scurrying around out here. God. But if we see something, we can safely take it out. All right, this is definitely bait. I should not be going this way. All right, I guess we're fine. And you know what? It's good to use my shotgun because we got plenty of ammo and we want to make space. Okay. A safe place. Um, nice. Okay, we're making progress. Making very good progress here. We go this way. Shit! <laughs> I keep scaring myself. Okay, I got a little bit turned around, but we've got a way to go over here. That's padlock C, which is wide open right now. We've got a way to go this way, which we need a code for. And a way over here. I kind of want to go check this out first. I don't, I don't want to go back in those grasslands unless I absolutely have to. Such tight corners. Don't tell me there's like a water section. I definitely won't go in it. Okay. 
Hold shift to run, spacebar to jump. I knew there was going to be parkour. But what happens if I drop down? Huh. Well, I'll take the money. And what is this? Antidote vial. If you're poisoned. Why would I be poisoned? And the word 20, the numbers 29 is written on it, but I can barely see it. Okay. That's cool. There we go. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't see. Are we poisoned? I don't think so. Damn, you're nasty. All right, I'm feeling good now. This shotgun is really nice. All right, so 2-9, which I have a feeling is half this code. I'm going to save the game again because we didn't really get hit that hard. Then I guess we go this way. Did I just see something move? I guess my eyes are playing tricks on me. Can we get some actual scaffolding down here? We're using wood tied together with a rope and it feels like the Stone Age. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't seem that well put together, actually. Oh, shit. You know what? Maybe it's friendly. But I don't know if I want to find out. Hopefully there's no Utah Raptors around here. He's so big. Okay, we got stuff over in there. I'm going to swing way down over in here. What's that? I don't know. Oh, it's so bright. If he turns around now, he will see me. Okay, I think we're good. That's definitely something. But I don't know what... Is that a frog? Looks like a giant-ass poison dart frog. Oh my god, it is. It's a big frog. I know that's going to kill me, but I'm not leaving here without going and fuck with a frog. I love frogs. If I'm going to die, I'm going to die with a frog for sure. Okay. I think I'm safe to stand up. More shotgun shells. 2-9 uh, is written on it with marker. I think I can remember 2-9. I'm definitely not going to remember 2-9. Um, what do I get rid of? I guess I'm going to discard the health file. I think we need the ammo. Oh, shit. You know what? This is actually really good. I'm going to combine this. Pick that up. All right, we're good. We definitely need an anti-poison thing. Stegosaurus was first discovered in 1877, Colorado. The animal has a set of large armored fins and a spiked tail that it can use with tremendous force. The fins are not directly attached to the animal's skeleton, but rather just come out of the skin. Okay, if it breaks the scale, it's a minor injury. Side note, several of the staff have grown very close to the cow-like nature of the Stegosaurus. However, they will get aggressive if provoked. Okay. That's nice. So... I should be fine just to walk around. They're like cows. As long as I don't shoot anything. Like this giant ass frog. Yeah, he's chill. Nice to see you, bud. Oh, I am so gonna touch you. <laughs> Ow! Boom! Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. But it was so worth it. That is such a cool looking frog. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess I use it. And we got a little bit more inventory space. Poor little buddy. I don't know why you were here or why you're so mean. All right, let's get out of here. So beautiful. Well, you know what? This seems like a pretty damn good place to end it. So I'm going to save the game really quick. There we go. And next time we'll pick up right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this so far because I am absolutely loving this. I mean, we got Utah Raptors, Stegosaurus, giant spiders, and giant frogs already. This is going to be pretty damn good. So let me know down in the comments if you guys are enjoying this because I would absolutely love to make more.
All right, so I'd like to give a big thank you to all my channel members. You guys are the best. And I'd like to give an extra special thanks to Bravo J and Mad Clown. They're my legendary supporters, so thank you. I really appreciate it. So if you guys liked today's episode, don't forget to drop a like. And if you guys want to see more episodes like this one in the future, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, guys. My name is Rooster, and I'll see you in the next one.